Yes, welcome back uh, to the Treasure Hunt number six brought to you by Trader Shed for round three of Swiss, featuring uh, Inket and Ryan Tan. I yep. think they did participate in some of our tournaments uh, already earlier. Yep. And, and Both players currently one and one. Mm, one and one. I think still have some chance. I would say. If they win out, they will. They will cut. Mm. So it's very simple. That's good. That's if good. Win out, you cut. If you lose, I think it's hard. But if you still go three two, there's a chance you bubble in. I but see. four will be guaranteed. I see. That's great. That's great to know. Uh, I personally have uh, communicated in Inket um, earlier. I mean, off off stream, yes, right? Sir. Yes, you can start. Yeah. So off stream, and uh, he he's kind of a very bo one uh, style player. Uh, he did try out some new text, and hopefully we will see some of it. I think he's you are also a personal favorite, judging from the composition. Rain. Yeah, I love rain. Yeah, rain is so good. Rainbow. So, uh, whereas Ryan actually featuring uh something very unorthodox as well. Clevo, uh, maybe you can help me recap when, what what they do. Because I think I saw it once yeah. featured in Treasure Hunt Five. The previous Treasure Hunt. Yes. It's also the Trice Cuff set. I see. So I see. Stone Axe does a lot of damage, boosted by the sharpness, and will leave the block on the field. I see. So uh, let's uh, introduce the team. For Ryan, will be uh, Tornidus, Urshifu, Lightly in Rapid Strike, uh, Xian Bao, Dragonite, uh, uh, Clevo, and Vatami. Yeah, Very and fast. Also. In Gear side, we see the Vesco Legion, Caliper, Thunderous Barrier, the Lungus, Gudra, Hisuian, and the Flutterman. To me, the standout is Thunderous Barrier. I mean, maybe just try to educate me. I mean, it's very much a rain of user. Because I think Wild Boat Storm is the, is the equivalent. We've seen Brick Wind a lot, so we just use a lot. Wild Boat is the electric equivalent. But with a much more useful side effect, Paralysis. is Paralysis. <laughs> I see, I see. And it is, of course, 100% uh, accurate in the rain. Mm. And looking at his item, I mean, from, from the team review, you will see that, wow. That damage is serious. Yeah, that damage, damage is very, difficult. very, very hard. Yeah, with choice specs and in the rain. yeah, and miss. So, well, I, 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 I'm hoping to see some fast pace action for both for both sides because they both seem to be running fast. Teams. Yeah, I don't think Cleaver can really afford to come out because Cleaver gets outsped by Vespiglia in the rain, just gets wiped out immediately. Mm, Even I if see. you don't get outsped, you're very vulnerable to the Aqua Jet. But he does bring the Cleaver. But oh yeah, so if you don't see the rain come out for Pinky, it brings out the Mungus and the Udra D instead, ah. trying to force a shelter turn one. Mm. And he might get it. I think he think yes, right? There's not much uh, Ryan can do to, to get around the rage powder on the Mungus. Stop I see. the turn one shelter. So he yeah. can't taunt the Mungus. And he can taunt the Mungus, sure. But the Udra but the is guaranteed to get at least one defense boost. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm quite sure uh, Ryan has to be very mindful of this because if he gets up too, ma too many shelters, uh, Udra will be unstoppable. Want to get another Unbreakable, I would say. Want to get another player going for shelter. <laughs> he, didn't, he didn't manage to get access to the acid armor. I see, I see. So, well... Uh, what do you lock yourself into though? I saw shelter. I saw it. No, what, what does the people want to lock yourself into? Ah. Since you, I think you might want to U-turn now. Goes for the taunt into the Mungus redirection. Mm. So Mungus is taunted now. Only be able to use the column path. Yeah. Oh, you went for Stone X instead. Stone X. So locks itself into Stone X, gets the stuff rock on the field. But at this point, uh, Inkia doesn't really want to switch. He has to go down the field. He, he has no incentive to, to, to have one shelter up. Yeah. And likely another one. No, I think the next one you will probably stop by taunt. So you don't really want to go for second shelter. I think you start going for the AB. For the idea of the AB slam, which is probably going to kill Cleaver at this range. Cleaver is weak to steal. Mm. Or the body press. Any any safe switches for Ryan to uh, at least account for body press? I mean, right now both of his Pokemon the few actually are okay with body press. Cleaver is neutral, mm. Cornelius does resist. Mm. But the uh, Cornelius actually has to stay in and taunt one more time. You can't afford, even though he's probably going to attack this turn, I think you need to get a taunt on there to stop any shenanigans. Yeah, to let him, don't, don't let uh, the. Don't let any potential life deal come out later in the game. Oh, but, but for his set though, I, oh, I don't see life deal. Yeah. deal. Shelter, yes. body press, heavy slam. Just have to protect instead of yeah. life deal. Protect. Yeah, okay. we do see the Tom go off, so you would think that it's pretty predictable for Ikea, so I, I, would, I wouldn't expect to see a shelter this turn. Mm -hmm. And Stone X into the Among Us shouldn't KO after what we saw in the first. Yeah, not enough. And who will rock? I, I think he went for well. Yeah, goes for the Body Breast. Is that enough at this range? Ooh, oh, hangs on. Hangs on. And but the Body Buff can go off. Yeah. The, but yeah, I think he still has full health. Yeah. <laughs> Perhaps he was expecting the Stone X to go on. Into the Gudra. But Gudra is still, so I don't think it's really a concern. Udra does, I mean, he trying to get some mileage. He, he doesn't want to switch the Mongols out. Because yeah. whatever to the back will, get, will take stealth for the damage on the way. Yeah, so, so, so no uh, no real incentive for him. And he doesn't really, I don't think he's, I don't think there's so much value to preserving a Mongols, even though we get the generator. Mm. I think he'd rather keep the Mongols on a field to get rid of it. Yes. Naturally. And I believe the previous turn he already taunted. So both are taunted now. But yeah, I think that's one thing. I think that's important. I think Inki has a newer player. Mm. I think he might not realize the heavy slam will probably button the KO there on the Cleaver. Because the Cleaver is light, right? Because Cleaver is weak to steal. 
Yeah. Or was he covering for something switching in? But yeah, body brand is pretty good neutral. Yeah, I guess. Like neutral to a lot of stuff in this. That's that. Okay, but this... You can put up the KO on the Among Us. Yeah. Yes. Tony does. They traded because of the Rocky Hour chip. Yeah. But what would... What would Liquid, neutral? probably. Yeah. Ooh, the oh, the beast though! I mean, it's 80%. <laughs> yeah. Okay, body press. It's not fun. Oh, yes. Still some good chunk. Again, uh, if he's gonna put a pro, have done more. Yeah. I don't know whether he will realize that. Though. Yeah, I, I know. Because, I mean, Tony is, you know, in the air. Yeah. He's a genie. Yes. Not much weight there. Eh? I'll now prime time to use heavy stat, for sure. Now, I mean, okay, I mean, both are the same here. Mm. I mean, body press is four times effective for Unchamp Pound. Uh, right, because of uh, size and dark. Eyes and dark, yeah. So right, now we see the now we see the where the value of the stuff from. That's break the, the sash on the way in, mm. and it's super effective on that. Chunking significantly as well. Lightly also uh, making big win, hundred percent accurate. Big win, hundred percent accurate. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So that's right one. Now. That's one uh, risk of bringing your own rain. Yeah. That you don't do boost your your opposing tornadoes. Yes. I can see that uh, from his choice. Lightly, he might want to opt for Terra. Uh, to stop potential secret swap for Chien Pao. So, let's see. I mean, your, 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 your win condition really is the Kudra. At just set two, up. I think you can just sit there. Sit there, set up. Get rid of the Tornadus, and then once the Tornadus is gone, and the Torn wears off, you can shelter again. And I don't think that's really an answer on his side. For plus two shelter, right? Because so. there's nothing on his side that can hit a fairy super effective. Yep. Yeah, Correctly predicting the secret swap. Yes. The speed wing comes off. It's a speed drop, right? If you, yes, if you, get, the you effect, get the effect. Yes. Yeah. If you get it. And that's gonna speed ah, drop. It doesn't really matter. matter. Yes. But it goes for the hurricane. So uh uncharted accurate in the ring. Like yeah. the big win. Was he opting for confusion chance? Oh I mean, the double it. Yeah, so that was a guaranteed KO. Likely to account for the focus sash. Yeah, I think it's, he can pretty safely just ignore the tornado. It's just it's not doing enough damage to the draw. Mm, and enough. it's not like it's not like in past years where you're worried about hurricane confusion. Big yeah. win does not have a confusion chance. Yes, that's right. But although And uh, you should call the Donald Duck Tornadus has to turn again yeah. if you want to stop any potential shelter. Exactly. I mean he could protect, right? I mean uh, he could stop that from like going for tailwind. Uh, now the risk of course is that Urshifu is also boosted in the rain. Mm, would it be enough to KO Gudra because Not with the shelter. Yeah. Because he can't create Gudra. Right? Because Gudra of has a shell, has armor. shell yeah. armor, right? So I personally would protect Tailwind. What about if I were I mean you could try. Mm. Yeah, just to you know, See if you can get yeah. assuming that to, he re Ryan recognizes that he cannot let him afford to let the drop on his again. So, knowing that, for that, they will let it go down and then uh, you can move on from that. Who does your Terra come out to push it through? As we saw, yeah, I think it's the water. Yeah, he wouldn't mind that it goes down. I still think not enough. I don't think this is enough. Definitely no, right? Not, even with combined with the Blade Wind, I don't think this is enough. Yeah. Unless <laughs> Gujarat is just not running any defense at all, I don't think this is enough. His item is... Oh, he is Mystic Water, so hmm... Quite shaky, isn't it? Might be, it might get a little uncomfortable for Inkyet. Could be if he survives in the rain. Let's see. Here comes the Strikes Terra Water Booster in the rain. Not can't crit, but Still this is Terra Water in the yeah, rain. Yeah, it's Terra Water. Up. Ooh, okay, that's gonna be enough. Not, not, definitely Why, will not, not be running? Why did he crit? He's not running. Oh, he's not <laughs> <laughs> He's not running shell armor! Oh. Okay, okay, I don't know whether he, he realized that or is it intentional? Uh, well, this is why, I mean, this is why you run shell armor. Because, uh, likely because of the choice of Sap Sipper is because it's it stops spore, spore. Yes, but yeah, it seems you see why this, there's so much shell in the game. Mm. So, and Vesculision, the, the big problem with Vesculision is that Vesculision does not have spare attacks. Yeah, so now, he kill one thing at a time. now it's a bit shaky because now he can only kill one thing at a time. Uh, likely the best religion And is you probably have to take recoil in the process. Wave crash, right? But at this point, I mean, Aquajet will kill Tornado, so there's that. But yeah. can you really afford to take a hit from Urshifu? I don't think so, no, I don't think so. Resist, but you're not very bulky. Best religion is frail. Yeah. yeah. Okay, perhaps guarantee some speed control there. Whoa, he's faster. Oh, yeah, never mind. Okay, yeah. I think mean, Inket in in was quite surprised at that speed here. No, no, Urshifu is naturally faster than best religion. Ah, even with, with the also without tailwind, uh, with tailwind it just matches the speed, so both are double. Mm. In which case, Urshifu would be faster. I see, I see. Yeah, it's, it's something that best vision needs to be wary of. Mm. Okay. It's last respects, but it's yeah, it's I, not gonna matter because Tunidus is also faster now. Yeah. And one big win will finish off the game. Oh, but he has Aqua Jet. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. <laughs> oh, but he's like, oh, you kill yourself like for recording. Yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't oh, matter. Okay. Yeah, now, now he's gonna kill himself. Yeah. So. And then he has Cleaver to clean up. Oh yeah, he still has Cleaver, yeah. yeah. So he was fine. Yeah, he was fine. Somehow, but he, yeah, he probably needed the upper jet last. 
Yeah, but you can't kill Oshiku regardless. Yeah. I think he was stuck there. Do you feel that he was hampered uh, some way or another uh, because Kudra wasn't able to get the shelter up quickly? It didn't matter. Because the fact that not having shell armor means your shelters don't matter in front of Oshiku. Oshiku will just creep through you. Creep no through you, what. right. Yeah, so... Oh. so which then brings to the fact is, in which case, shelter is not even a good game plan at all. If you lose then you have you, you can't answer the Urshifu. Mr. Urshifu can come in whenever he wants. Own time, own target, pick you off. Sure. Ah. So Would you think case, yeah, Flutter like, Bane, maybe? I don't know. So, so try every, to get you on the speed control. The, the, entire, the entire game plan makes sense if you are Shell Armor. Mm. But now that, we, now that we've realized that it's not Shell Armor, you, you can't do that in front of Urshifu. Yeah, it has to probably prioritize it. Uh, and you're giving it rain as well. It's, it's a bit like aiding uh, Riot in a sense. Like, Although I don't see Cleavor really contributing that much, um, except the Stone X. But the uh, the thing about Cleavor is that the, the lead we saw in game one is honestly quite vulnerable to Vesper Legion because even if you tailwind to get Cleavor, pick Cleavor faster than Vesper Legion, uh, oh. Cleavor is weak to water, so Vesper Legion can just knock it out in upper jet. I think he's probably thinking along that same line, looking at his uh, first uh, choices in the team brief. He's like, I mean, as a as someone who's played a lot of rain this year, mm. I think it's you you. Your opponent tends to want to bring tornadoes because tornadoes can throw in and get get the At least to faster match. than Vesquilligion. Mm. But honestly, Vesquilligion has quite a lot has quite a lot of options even in that scenario. I see. Like we saw here, the upper jet is just a really good option. You can KO tornadoes, mm. you can KO the cleaver. Mm. At least two are pinned, and it, and and uh, Ryan's team uh, Ryan's team cannot stop a priority. Anything. And a cleaver is forced to Terra Water to get KO with the surge. And we saw it doesn't even KO even in the rain. Or to resist potential aqua jet. No no no, he's already resist anyway. Yeah. So it Matter, right? So it's really for the offense. Mm. But we saw just now it doesn't kill Vesquilligion for full health. So Vesquilligion right. gets at least two turns. Yeah. So and he can kill everything else other than the Ashifu. So that's something that but can he might consider. But can his uh Ashifu change moves? It was in Mystic Water. It's Mystic Water. So he can't close combat into Vesquilligion. Can he Aqua Jet? Will it be faster? Aqua uh, yes, but, that, but it's already faster regardless. If we kill him, you're already faster. Mm. But Vesquilligion is already at least one attack. Mm. And if Vesquilligion can Aqua Jet, can, Aqua Jet can kill two of Ashifu's partners mm. potentially. Mm. Looks like he, he picked uh, Rain Mode this time. Uh, I straight think up. I think again. And it will be the Rain Mode coming out from MTF. I think he should. He needs to realize that if the tailing goes up, the best position will be slower than Cleaver. So he needs to go for Aqua Jet into the Cleaver if he wants to get the KO. Yeah, but uh, he uh, looking at his first choice for, for, for Caliper, right? He, he's opting for Dewey, but I can sense that Torn is coming, right? He has to stop it's a very, it, right? It's a very, it's a very straightforward Torn on Tornado's side. Yeah, but will he be incentivized to do that? Why? That's what, at this point? This, this is why I think he needs to punish with the Aqua Jet into the Cleaver. Mm. Regardless of what it comes in, right? Because I don't think in this lineup, nothing can really take an Aqua Jet in vain. Yeah. Not flutter. Maybe Dragon Knight. Certainly a Shifu, but you don't want your Shifu to be chunked so much. Really. Shifu takes it pretty well. The Shifu's yeah. defense is pretty high. Okay. But okay. okay. Cleaver, no way. Do you see a Terra step on Cleaver to survive Aqua Jet? Uh, whoa, wait a minute. He's what was grass? Oh yeah, maybe. Yeah, has to be. Okay. But committing uh, our terror on Cleaver doesn't always doesn't doesn't feel really optimal, right? Yeah, doesn't feel that <laughs> much value. But we'll see how this game goes. Okay. So we do see the Thorn come out in the driver. Stopping the Cleaver. Stopping the Cleaver. Yeah. So Vesquilligion should be faster than the Cleaver. Yes, goes for the wave crash into Lightly the Cleaver, right? Into okay, we we'll pick up the KO on Tony. So no tailwind for either player this time. In this game. At least uh Unless for the comes in and comes yeah. yeah. So actually that, and that, that should Ooh, that's a lot of record and the life off. Stone oh Terra Blast. Oh, that should kill that speed. That that trading. But will you feel that because you, you also mentioned in the analysis, right? KOing Tornado's first was key. So he did achieve that by what cost? Mm, I think it's okay because he's forced the Terra commit into the cleaver. Mm. Which means that Gudra at least take the achievable hits a bit better now. Mm. Okay, or without the mm, mystic, but as we uh, see from the four he brought, it's gonna be, it's gonna, it's really gonna be reliant on the Gudra. Yeah, much more passive play. So since we do expect Ashiku to come in distant, so can does he does he feel safe to go for the uh, shelter? It looks like not. He goes for the moon. No right. Yeah. So for me, I think the obvious play uh, uh, would be. I don't know. Brown or Cleaver, he's not he's not into grass terra blocks. He cannot hurt the Amogus. Which means it's a free switch. And Ashiku can't really hurt the Amogus. So yeah. So now. He, but I think he's, he's free to land something with the other Yeah, system. I personally would go for Spore or the Cleaver slot because uh, it's the most chance to switch out anyway. So. Let's see if anything goggles at the back. 
like Nino, right? No. Yeah. So yeah, it's a, it's a free, free sport something. Free right? sport. That's not. Good. Yeah. Although I'm interested to know what the Shifu is going to do. Okay. Yeah. A uh, very passive play. Calling the spot into that slot. Yeah. But he just goes for the rage power. That's the thing, right? He get did not capitalize on mm. this. It's very likely. Yeah, yeah I'm not sure why. why. I'm not I, sure I why. I don't understand yeah. why. Yeah. Tried to pull the, I mean, he tried to pull the Terra Blast, but there was no way Ryan was staying in. Yeah. yeah. I, feel, I felt that it was a very obvious spot and quite free. So, so that's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot of lot. It's a lot of lost momentum for Inkyat. Yeah. And he's already falling behind. And look at look at uh, his choice. He's choosing to Terra still is uh, a yeah. uh, I'm finding I'm Ooh. finding quite difficult to understand why why still Arbugus. Oh, so, I'm uh, very. Uh, I mean, he wants to resist Icicle Crash or X Spinner rather. But there will be things yeah, that are neutral, all right? All of a sudden, a Shiloh can hit you neutral. Yeah. And super effective. Uh, close combat. And you were and previously Water. you resisted both Shiloh's yeah. moves, and but now you're either weak or neutral. Yeah. So you're really counting on the hurricane to take out a full distance. And in fact, Jian Bao can cover for it uh, by Secret Sword. So now, sure, shaky, it could be quite shaky. Goes for the Rage Powder, okay. So first off, Jian Bao. Does he get the Ice Spinner? That's what yeah. he, he needs the Ice Spinner this yeah. time. Yeah, okay. okay, he gets one. He read that, but, he resisted. Uh, I think Surging Strikes my KO. <laughs> at, least, neutral. at this range, probably. Oh, with Rocky Helmet, at least, at least he gets Rocky Helmet. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa! No! He, he's I, I thought take, he would survive. He didn't even take two hits. I don't think so. Can he at least take three? Oh, oh yeah, not even three. That's it. So he only gets two ticks off the Rocky Helmet chip onto the Hushifu. Uh, but yeah. Hurricane should pick it up this turn. Then it's all right. down, then it's all down to the Gudra. Gudra. Yeah. He needs to get he needs to kill a Shifu this turn. Because then Gudra has a chance to so he just tank through the rest of the game. Okay. Hurricane into the Hushifu. He should fail. So but Gudra against Xin Bao though. It's tough, yeah. Secret Sword does about 40%. Yeah. He's gonna need he's gonna need at least one turn to shelter. Yeah, protect protect tailwind maybe, right? Ooh, so. I don't think I afford to do that. Because if, I think Ryan has a Ryan should just this oh, time Ryan should just, slot, this Ryan time. should just double his cleaver, he's still cleaver. Ah, okay. Ryan should, I think Ryan Ryan can just double the Maliper, get off the field, deny any potential tailwind. Because double by spinner and something, right? Spinner plus or so next. Oh no, no you, you, you want something you can hit the draft. Oh, what are the moves that oh, uh, close combat? He has close combat. Okay, okay. But lock himself into close combat. Mm. I wouldn't do that, right? But you. But thing is, turn one. You will be exposing yourself to the body press because if you drop your defense. That's what you have come down to. Come down to this turn. Whether or not uh, Inkyan protects his Gudra, whether or not Ryan calls to protect Gudra. Because okay. he, if he doesn't, if he doesn't protect and Ryan doubles the Gudra, Gudra just goes down. Mm. Close combat plus Secret Sword. That's going to KO Gudra. Should KO Gudra with with, with, yeah. without any uh, boost. Okay, he goes for the protect. That, did Ryan call it? He needs to, because if Tailwind goes up, then that's where he has a chance to go. Oh, it does double. Okay, he does Close combat into the protect. Yeah. Does he secret into the protect as well? Or oh, Ice Spinner to cover? He Ice Spinner into protect. I don't think he will KO, right? No, he's sad. He's sad. Yeah, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, he needs confusion, I think. <laughs> oh, oh he's he's a great, right? Oh, no, he's no, not. He's KO, yeah. Ouch. I, I didn't realize he was, oh, yeah, he was chipped from the Rocky Helmet. Wow, I didn't know Hariki is that powerful. Oh, no. Chen Pao is very frail. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, that changes things, right? Because now people will go down to the Hydro Pump, I believe. If he has it. He has Hydro Pump. Uh, no. Yes, yeah, he does. Oh, does he? Yes, Hydro Pump. Yeah. Well, yeah, he, goes, he, has to, he has to go for Pelipper. Yeah. Now he needs Hydro Pump to miss. <laughs> Hydro pump, no lah, maybe oh, not hydro pump, yeah, yeah, it's grass, yeah, it's grass. So, Harikei will be more yeah. optimal, yeah. So and with the defense drop from close combat. Yes, and both, both, both are on par, on a 1-1 one one and taking us to a game 3. Yeah, so that, we saw in the previous time, he just doubled the Pelipper this game. Like, yeah, I felt that, yeah, at, would you feel that it's a call? Like, not really, I think it's a very safe play to double the Pelipper. Yeah. Mm. Safe play, okay, because the, the protect was quite because obvious. Because you are, no matter what, you have blocked yourself into close combat. Yeah. You have to, right? Yeah. Because otherwise you can't touch uh, to drive at all, right? So, so in a sense, you have one turn before your opponent. Before you, have, you have one turn before your opponent realizes you're going to go combat. I think you just double the battle because mm. you have a guaranteed KO that That's such a loss of opportunity. Or maybe he expected the, the, the speed. Because no KO. Ah, helping Pelipper hand deal with Hydro Pump Hurricane. Pelipper, without protect on Pelipper, that, that means even if the shelter goes up, I think you're fine. Mm. Because you know, your first time will do less, but Secret Sword will ignore the shelter anyway. So it goes so you still wear down the Gudra now, and Gudra can't KO you immediately. Somehow I just felt that both players like, made moves that made them kind of lose momentum. 
let's think about let's take a step back and think about it. That says that free spawn very early yep. game would have helped to you know immobilize Qian Bao, which was the incoming one for at least a third. Somehow I just felt that it was such a loss of opportunity. And in this case, the second time that arrived, it was a Ryan side that has lost momentum, but not that big. Okay, yeah. You, you, no, you, 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 cannot, you cannot split your target scatter. There was no 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 reason to. Yeah. Right? There was no reason to. Like the attack the slot has falling back to basics. Will, by doing what he did, he spread attacks. And if you can't get KO on either, yeah. and if either attacks you, you just lose your one. And that's what we saw. The only reason why he did that was he won. He had that probably he had the impression that he was survived. Survive. He, 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 he thought maybe he could survive the hurricane from the Pelipper. Yeah. Like, well, come on man, I spinner on Pelipper. No, but he said so he had to double regardless. Ah oh yeah, he was full health. Full health. Yeah, so he had to double regardless. It's like he, and that's it's always been a try and true thing. Over the years, he always he kept saying to ourselves, you double the one that doesn't have attack. Yes, and it's and, and there's no incentive, it's, it's just falling back to the basics. So, for this case, uh, somehow I just felt that Ryan stumbled a bit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he, he had a game, he had a pretty good handle of the game, then he just... Handle of the game, and towards the tail end, yeah. kind of lost it. Mm. So, but that's okay. I mean, game 3 will be the time that he should be able to make redemption. So, Jian Bao Cleaver was straight up. Best region, Pelipper for Inkyet, remote once again, uh, no, just like Without Tailwind this time, that's honestly much, it's not a great position for Ryan, I think. Because Cleaver was immediately threatened by whatever attack Best region throws out. And Champion cannot kill Best region if it Terra's. Uh, what is the Terra type for Best region? He's running water, yeah. Yeah, so... For power. Mm. So water takes away your sucker punch weakness. Plus, boosting his own defensively as well because of the potential. Okay, you don't even need the Terra. You just go for Aqua Jet. Because you're in the range, you're faster than the Champa. So Champa cannot Sucker Punch you. Aqua Jet will go before the Sucker Punch. Oh, because of kill. the Swiss Swim. Yeah. Naturally, it's faster. Same priority break game. Aqua Jet will go. Yeah, the Sucker Punch will fail. Mm. So, so it's honestly, it's, Ryan, might have to, Ryan, I think, has to call this turn perfectly. Would you feel it? Okay, in case play blindly will be Aqua Jet and Tailwind. Yeah. yeah. I would think it's more of it. It's pretty safe. Yeah. Hopefully the Aqua Jet is the correct one. I will go for Cleaver. Is it Terra Water? Yeah. <laughs> or is that a Terra Grass? It's Terra Grass on Cleaver. Okay. So no Terra or any case. Uh, Again, defensively, uh, defensive maneuver. Very on a... That is the only reason. Most of the tech on this condition. Ooh, again, I feel a... Do you think Hurricane? A huge loss opportunity. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Oh. 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 Let's go and bring it to the Super Sash. And I think, yeah, I think he might, he might have double this turn. Yeah, double this turn, right? Because again, you, you let the best religion, you let the best religion get an attack off, sure. You add worse your trading, but you double Pelipper, guarantee deny the win. Yeah, you double. That's it. I mean, the Ooh, only speed yeah, control is gone. Best religion should not be protecting that turn. You've got a free attack into something this turn. Something. You're the fastest thing on the field. Yes. You're guaranteed to go first. With Crash, with Crash with Helping Hand will KO Clevo, even with Terra Grass. Yeah, at least chipping or even chipping Jian Bao. Uh, bring it to his Sash. Yes, yeah. at least bring it to Sash, getting rid of it. It's not meaningful. Why? What was that protect? I'm very <laughs> puzzled. puzzled <laughs> yeah, I'm also very puzzled. Because you have a way to dodge Sucker Punch, just Aqua Jet. Or you Terra your winners away, yeah. either yeah. way. Mm. But you don't protect. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will, I'm very curious, I will find out probably off speed yeah, one you're, Maybe you're afraid of Terra Grass, Blast Blast, like last game But you can just help me hand and, and just wave crash into the people And still, even though if it's not a KO, it's still some good damage I think it's okay KO in the Terra Water Really? Yeah. Oh. Okay, 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 okay Okay, now it's in case time Terra Likely the Mudra, right? It has to be, right? Yeah, Terra will the second soul yeah, has to be. But in the, at the same time, it, it means he will be neutral to the certain strikes later, which may be dangerous. Would, would, is he counting on best region to kind of kick it? Also not really. Yeah, no, best region doesn't can't really shake, take off. Kind of shaky, right? Yeah. yeah. Not until he has at least one more KO. Mm. And now he has a chance. One yeah. turn too late. He uh, has uh, to shelter, I think. So next to best region. Sure. Yeah. Wow, so so significant damage there. Yeah, so he has a shot down. Yeah. But again, Hashibu doesn't care. Yeah, now he doesn't care because of that, simply because of the fact that uh, it was can not crit. shell armor. Yeah, yeah, because he can crit. He can just crit through it. And well, Honestly, at this point, I wonder if Lost Respect can kill people. It's only 100, but... You mean Aqua Jet and Body Press? Can it? I mean, I think Body... I think Baby Slam will just straight up kill people. 
Wait, wait. I think so. You haven't seen it yet. But Tifo is big to, to steal. Oh, no, wait. Oh, no, it's it's Gara away. Yeah, yeah. So, so it will be neutral, right? Yeah. So, Vesuvius is going to protect again. And Sucker Punch into the okay. protect. Okay. Because of the... Is it Shelter? Did he Shelter again? He pressed yeah. Shelter again. I saw it. So... Oh, it's still a lot of damage. Through the Blast 2. Yeah. Uh, now it's Blast oh, 4, right? Yeah. Again, yeah. I don't. Some, I, some, I don't really quite the, understand the timing, either. The timing of his terrors yeah. are not optimal. Always understandable from, yes. our, from where we are. Mm. I would think. Okay, so probably. Okay, he, he's pressing body press. I think it's a bit one turn too late also. <laughs> but that's just me. He's also upper jet to dodge the sacrifice, I think. That's two, right? Yeah, yes, two. Both on, I mean, and both on the cleave as well. Probably, yeah. Yeah. Nothing in his team I mean, except Tornadoes or Wild. Anyway, whatever you do, you have double something. Don't kind of have spec. And he got his double protect. Yeah. I don't know, no, he no, sucked yeah, because he sucked it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, he put the. Not too bad. Yeah, yeah he kills straight up. Yeah. Even at only at 50. At 100. He, because he only lost one. Yeah, he lost one, one yeah. Okay, okay. Evo was just frail. I, I see. Like, I think Wave Crash would have been enough on turn 1, even with Terra Grass. I see, I see. Wow. Oh, yeah, at least in the ring. I don't know. But, uh, but now, now, now he has content with plus 4, so. Again, no, Hiro doesn't care. The Hiro is going to come in there and certainly strike him. I, I'm quite sure it's and a last turn of Wave Crash. Right? And he can cover the Vestrusion with Dr. Bunch, forcing the Aqua Jet. Yes. So. Maybe Aqua Jet and... He has one turn, I think. He was about one to this turn. Yeah, Aqua Jet and Body Press, maybe? And he, and, and he bottomed it for Inky Ed's that Ryan has really burned his Terra on the keyboard. So he and, can't Terra water. And hopefully he remembers that this is the last turn of Rain also. So. Yeah, he is not, yeah. not there. Aqua Jet into a into a Champ sorry. Okay. Yeah, brings it down. So that, that he suck a bunch. Oh, he kills himself. So suck a bunch won't go off yeah, if we'll he go goes off. into Kudra. Alright. Yeah, it does go into Kudra, but it's resistant. But it doesn't it matter. Four, yeah, but it all comes from research, right? Yes. How much does it do? If it survives... Ooh, ooh I don't think he's going to survive. Let, let's take a minute, let's take a minute. Oh, no, definitely no. <laughs> okay. It doesn't matter how many shelters you have. Yeah. You don't have shell armor, but she will crit through you. That is why you have to run shell armor. Shell armor, yeah. I personally wouldn't feel that he would be very afraid of... He should be not so afraid of sleep, because... You have a lot of powerhouse. Think about Gudra like, that even whenever you like when you see a typical Gudra game, mm. Gudra doesn't really care about you because because he's like say to, to shelter, yeah. Mongol supports you. Yeah. But because you're so bulky, you can afford to stay around until you wake yeah. up. I I I I'm okay. I will be okay with that. Yeah. Because so you have a defense boost. Yeah. You can't be crit. So just stay around, let Mongols use you up, you wake up, shelter again. Yeah. And you kill the Mongols. Yes. So it's, it's really not an issue. You have to play a long drawn game when it Whereas, comes to without without shell armor, a shield will just wipe you out as we're seeing here. Yeah. That, I mean. You have to account for Shifu, right? You have to. In this yes. map, Shifu is top 5. Yeah, you have to account for that. I mean, I was quite sur I mean, I, I personally am quite surprised, uh, the, the, at least in the ability choices for for for, for uh, Budra or for Inky. And I, I don't think this is going to help much. I, I haven't seen I haven't seen Giga Drink Among Us in years. <laughs> <laughs> but Jie Bao and likely the last slot will be Maybe don't uh, we can see Cleave or Tian Pao, or should we likely Flutter Bay, right? Yeah, Flutter Bay to clean this up. Shadow Ball. I mean, Tian Pao is all okay. I mean, yeah. It doesn't matter. Tian Pao at this point will just kill. Probably, right? At this range. So, Spinner is going to kill from here. Yeah. So unfortunate that some of the choices that he made in his team uh, may have um, caused his death. The really, the thing is that in that turn one, especially, that protect. he had to. Well, the moment the, on turn one you have to speed advantage because he has no uh, tailwind on the field, so you have to press the advantage. And he didn't. He went for the protect instead. And and I think Brian learned. And, and in game two we saw Brian learn his lesson. He didn't double the critical and he lost. In game three he was not just gonna double the critical and he yes. lost. And, 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 and that was the the, the, the turning point in turn one. So people though no speed control for TK anymore. Uh, and Brian takes his set to one. Also. Right. And, and what you say, the, the, the pivotal part is where he realized Pelipper can't protect. 
the people part was when we realized it's not shell. Then it was like, oh, it was all <laughs> downhill from the yeah, yeah. from, from us, casters, who analyzed the game. And you know, I just I felt that some of his team choices were just some of I mean, at least in the game. The core is fine, but it's a bit. At the beginning, we thought this thing looks good, it looks pretty good. But the moment we realized, once we saw the uh, critical, hit, once we saw the words critical hit, we were like, what's going what's on? Going on? Come on, man! I mean, your team isn't that weak to rain and they out to score. He wouldn't go to sleep. He would have one game one if he was shot up. Yeah, sit there, just get another shelter up. Press, 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 press. I wanted to get rid of four. Nothing much to really, you know, say. Good on paper, but the execution is just And again, the thing is, you already have many answers for this. You don't need to withdraw for that. Hurricane. You have Hurricane on paper. You're just pressing through with the resolution attacks. You're not afraid of it. You don't need stats. Yeah, that set sequel was over extending. So unfortunate there. Well, looks like Ryan will be at least 2-1 now. Have a good chance to advance the top card. Unfortunately, Ike will be out of the running, like me, yeah, like me out of the running. Uh, some reflection for him, yeah, I, I'm for sure. So, well, we'll see you on round 4 of Swiss for Treasure Hunt number 6. Uh, we'll see you later.